Hey everybody, welcome to another episode of 60 Formula, home of the Husky community. Hope you're doing well today. What's up, Lady McGrady? Can I get a paw? <laughs> <laughs> what was that? Are you leaving the scene? You done with the video today? Yeah, I'm gonna come get you. Britney Spears, come sit. Good boy, can I get a paw? Yeah, can I get another paw? Yeah, dude. Yeah, you're the smart one. Yeah, give me some pets and some cuds, big Dewey. Yeah, look at that big black nose, I love it. You look like a polar bear. You look like a polar bear. So I hope you're all doing well today. I've just been keeping this place immaculately clean, making sure it's beautified like it has been since the day we walked right on in. And let me tell you something, cleaning up after Huskies, like having to clean up after them on a regular basis is a full-time job, and if you don't believe me, don't do it. So yo, for all of those of you out there that have an Xbox Series X, here are the games I have. I play Call of Duty Modern Warfare. I love to play some Zom Zoms. Uh, I haven't really played Cyberpunk or Assassin's Creed Valhalla, but what kind of games am I missing out on? What kind of games don't I have that I should be playing? List them down in the comments below, because I got that sex box, baby. But look at them little bean heads, just like sitting right at the door. Hello, little bean head. Hello, pepperoni pizza. Oh, oh, you got tagged, bro, you're it. Oh, you're it, bro. Oh! Oh! <laughs> Gila is in a mood right now. <laughs> Go, Britney Spears! Run for your life, boy! Run for your life, son! Get her, B-Spears. Get her. <laughs> Uh-oh. You're cornered, bro. You're cornered. You give up, miss? That's what I thought. <laughs> you can't overpower the Spears, baby. He's got them big old ears, baby. Oh, so you can see over there, I'm still working on the Tacoma, and for some reason, oh, here, come over here, I'll show you real quick. Oh, real quick, by the way, these are all of the shells that I have found driving on the beach. Ex uh, excuse me, man, I'm literally three and a half inches from you, just Chilio Maximo. So, welcome to my Toyota Tacoma. So, for some reason, my windshield wiper fluid is not making it up here and I'm almost certain at this point that it is the pump that is connected to the fluid washer but I can't reach it from here because as you can see it goes down into that little section so I'm gonna have to remove that piece to get to the pump and then hopefully I can just go over to O'Reilly's grab a pump and replace it real quick that is the plan if you have a first gen Toyota Tacoma and you've had to replace the windshield wiper fluid pump before let me know how you did it that would be super helpful I'm gonna go ahead and try and do it today but uh you won't see that in this video oh yeah and I totally forgot to show you guys that I painted the bumper and it is it's so good it looks like brand new came out amazing Basically just as good as the fender flares. Heck yeah. Alrighty, so on today's episode, we're gonna be talking about what you should be feeding your Siberian Huskies. Or basically, I'm just gonna share with you guys what I feed my Siberian Huskies. I'm gonna take you to the store, I'm gonna show you the different options of food that I kinda sift through and look through in order to pick which food we're gonna go with. Because if you guys aren't aware, I do practice a rotational diet, so we don't always get the exact same kibble every time, but I like to make sure that it is consistent, like it's got the same type of ingredients. So I'm gonna show you the good ones. I'm gonna show you the not so good ones And I'm gonna show you the one that I end up taking home today and the ones that my huskies ultimately eat on a regular basis Now there's a lot of you out there that like think that I still have my huskies on a raw diet I do not 
they do eat a mixture of wet food and kibble every night. That still can get expensive, just as expensive as raw food. Raw feeding is just not for everybody, uh, in my professional opinion, especially with people who have little children. But you know, everybody's everybody and to each their own. So if you feed your Siberian Husky a raw food diet, that's awesome. If it works for them, that is the dopest thing ever. Continue doing that. You probably don't need to watch this video, but if you like Husky cuteness, I definitely suggest that you stay tuned because we're gonna have cinnamon buns all over the place. Now here in Florida, it is getting much colder. Like it is not the hot climate that you'd expect or think of in Florida. This is why the Huskies are loving it outside right now and why Britney Spears is like, dude, I'm just, I'm, I'm ice bathing. It's a cool 60 degrees outside right now, which means it's a little chilly for me, but for the Huskies, it's like the AC is on full blast outdoors. So without further ado, let's go ahead and jump in my Jeep. Let's go on over to Pet Supermarket and browse the food choices that I like to buy. You ready, dude? You ready? Yeah? <laughs> All right, one in the back and one in the front. Britney Spears, you can't have shotgun, dog. His ladies have shotgun. <laughs> All right, well then you gotta ask your sister to get in first. That's the, that's gonna be the deal. In. Go back. Back here. Good boy, good boy. Good girl. Ready? supermarket have a healthier pet for less all right here we are we're looking at all of the Merrick food whenever I come into a pet supermarket or a pet smart I go straight to the aisle that has Merrick products Merrick has so many different varieties of foods you have your grain free you have your healthy grain option so if you don't want to go full grain free or you want to add some grain to your dog's diet they give you the ability to choose that option now I'm going to show you right here the first thing is they have a grain free option which I don't recommend and you're going to be like why don't you recommend grain free I've been giving my dog grain free for forever I hear it's good there's a lot of claims out there and a lot of evidence to support that if you stick with a grain free diet with your dog it increases the chances of cardiomyopathy which is like a heart disease or a heart problem that your dog can basically get after years of eating a grain free diet so what I like to do is I will add some grain free products to their diet and you'll see that but I like them to get healthy grains on a regular basis. So now that you know that, you can see right here, this is the healthy grains option, and they have this option for not only adult dogs, but they have it for puppies as well. Next, we're looking at wet food, and with these cans, basically, I try and stick with a gravy. I hate pate, and the difference between pate and gravy is that when the food is in pate form, it's like spam, all diced and mushed together into like this paste. I think it's gross. I would wouldn't eat it myself. The gravy is a much better option because it moisturizes the kibble, kind of prevents it from being so hard on your dog's teeth. It's good to get moisture in your dog's kibble, so I like the gravy option the best. I feed my Huskies 
half a can each. So I split one can between the two of them every single night so they never eat a whole can. And I also mix it with their kibble. Not only does this help entice my Huskies to eat, having wet food is it's smelly, it really gets them interested in wanting to eat, but it also makes it easier to eat and digest the kibble when you're eating it with something else that has a little bit of lubrication to it. So okay, let's go ahead and check all this stuff out and get home and I'll show you exactly what we picked out. All right, so what we went with today is the classic healthy grain version of real chicken and bra Ross Russell with them ancient grains, boy. And it tells you right here, 54% protein, healthy fat ingredients, 46% whole grains, produce, fiber, vitamins, minerals, and other ingredients. Now the best part about this is it's pea-free, lentil-free, potato-free, so you don't have like the fillers that end up making your pepperoni pizza plumpified. It's got omega-6 fatty acids, omega-3 fatty acids, so you make sure your coat is getting all nice and shiny glucosamine, chondroitin, antioxidants, all the things you need to make your dog healthy. So realistically, this is the brand I go with, Merrick, always. I just really like it. There are other ones I do like. Sometimes I will go with Taste of the Wild because Taste of the Wild actually has a grain option now that has like healthy grains in it. So I will get Taste of the Wild sometimes. There's also this that I got with this. Now, I switch this up a lot. This is the Big Texas Steak Tips Dinner. It'll totally complete with big chunks of beef and gravy. Now, you can see that this is grain free. It says it right here down at the bottom. And that's okay as long as we're giving our dogs some grain in the kibble. Now, actually, I prefer to do this because if you're going to give your husky like something uh, like wet food and it has grains in it, you don't want to overdose on the grainage. Now, I know we're kind of overdosing on the protein a little bit. This is chicken. I like to switch it up. If you're going to do, you know, salmon, you can do something, just do different proteins. I don't want to do like chicken on chicken on chicken. And just so you know, the reason I give them a little bit of wet food, preferably something in gravy, always gravy. I hate pate. If it's pate, go away. Gravy helps kind of moisturize the kibble, which if you don't do, it will hurt your dog's teeth. Their teeth will be like, oh my goodness, I gotta go to a dentist once I'm only three and a half years old because I've crunchified everything out of them. Yeah, just like imagine eating cereal every day for every meal for the rest of your life, your teeth would hurt. So this is what you're trying to do. Look, everyone's gonna, you know, complain and moan in the comments below. This is the formula. This isn't the most healthiest option for my dog, Ronnie. I need the most the healthiest option. Here's the deal. Here's the deal. You want to find a balance somewhere in between the healthiest food and something really tasty. I mean, imagine eating rice cakes for the rest of your life. Yeah, it's healthy, but does it taste good? No, it's gross. You want to give your dog something to enjoy every once in a while. So if we're going to give them the healthy kibble, we might as well give them, you know, some really decadent, juicy stuff to put on top of it. Now, I don't give one can per dog. I split this can in half and they each get half a can. So it's not like they're getting tons of it. They're getting mostly the kibble and then just a little treat right on top. So this is what they will eat for dinner tonight. I, I love Merrick. They have so many different options. They do have the grain free, which I don't recommend, but like you saw in today's video, they have so many different ancient grain, healthy grain options that you can explore for you and your dog. What do you think? Was today fun? Did you learn a lot? All about your food? Go on a Jeep ride? Was it great? She's like, I've been doing YouTube for so long, Daddy O. You can't, you can't intimidate me with a camera. There ain't no none of that funny stuff, yo. Yeah, give me a paw. Give me a paw. Yeah, you the best. You the best. We had a blast hanging out with you guys today, Jeep riding, talking about the types of foods that Gila and Britney Spears eat on a regular basis. We hope that it helps you make a decision on what you want to feed your Siberian Husky because our Huskies are happy dappy and also healthy, uh, uh, wealthy? I, I don't know. If you guys had fun, be sure to smash that like button and hit subscribe for more free Huskaroni pizza information. To join the Husky community, all you got to do is go down below and say, yo, I'm part of the Husky community. Deal with it. Until next time we'll see you with another episode of guess what dude <laughs> that's right whatever we make peace scooby dee bop 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 ba doo ba doo ba doo ba doo ba doo ba doo ba doo